I'd like to open up the seduction suite. I'm not just your uh, Urban Erotica president. I'm a customer too. <laughs> I'm a player here. It's called Faces. So I'm doing this erotic gig. It's a private party. It's really hot up in the room. It's about 50 women in this living room. I'm doing erotic poetry. I'm supposed to warm up before. I'm supposed to. I'm supposed to warm up the set before the uh, adult dancers come. The male dancers come through. By the time I finish, my button down is wrinkled and full of sweat, half off. My shit is out. Their shit is out. The dancers about to go home because the, the erotic poetry just doesn't stop. Except for this one sister in the room sitting over in the corner sucking her teeth, making all these fucked up faces. Oops, did I curse? We don't curse in the seduction suite. Making all these faces, and ironically, I was inspired. What faces would you make if words morphed into action? If you rose from that couch with my whispered command, get up. Turned your back to me as you leaned forward, rested your hands on the sofa's back, your right knee on the seat, body faces the mirror on the wall. Your faces face me from over your left shoulder. Clothes disintegrate, fears evaporate. Your faces taunt me to walk my talk. My mouth devours an ankle as my hand seizes the other in a firm, sensuous grip. Hungry kisses and hands travel the length and the width of your long and supple scent. Calf muscles relax under the onslaught of my ravenous tongue. Teeth bore into your firm and moist. Knees buckle as I nibble their back. Thighs tremble as I clutch, claw, suckle, and disassemble your cultured composure with lips and hands. I linger excessively round the back and inner thighs. I linger till I feel your rainforest falling upon my bald expanse. I push my bare scalp. Ex I push my bare scalp into the exquisite agony as I swallow your little man and his boat. <laughs> as I swallow your potent nip, my hands press into your long-legged flesh. Your voice betrays your state of lost consciousness, newfound tran tantrics. When I have had my fill of your nectar for the moment, I move on to the small of your back and drip your essence up and down the grooves of your spine and drink it up again from your sculpted chalice, one vertebra at a time. Hands dig into the smooth brown shores banking your spinal river. Your contortions increase in swift, almost angered intensity as I quench more and more of my insatiable hunger and thirst from your skin and your burst, my smoldering breath invades the nape of your neck. Hot teeth bear down upon agitated nerves and searing flesh. Four hands, eight fingers, and ten knuckles lock into your vice fist. The mirror witnesses it all, all of your conflicting faces and twisting fancies. As I bear down on the back of your neck, your head surrenders and falls forward. A black mane of sweated perm engulfs your faces. <laughs> covers your crown like a shroud, masking the sights betrayed by the sounds emanating from down under your cowl. Elbows bend back, it arches, ass rises as my rigid intention pierces your soaking center. My push deep and unforgiving. Your pull quick and demanding. Your head, your head rears up and startles me in the mirror with your raw pain pleasure. I match it with hardened focus, laser-like strokes, steady poundings, sharp piercings, slow, strong, steady strokings, long, hard, forced, mining for your fiery diamonds. Rhythm switch from slow to quick, quick to dense, dense to thick, thick to nair quenched. We mount and surrender as if it were our last, as if the little death would exact actually take us this time. All for the conquer and command of your enigmatic faces. Thank you. Don't you love the faces we make? Mm -hmm.